Yo, what's good with y'all? In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a accessory command. It's very similar to the shirts and pants command. So, yeah, like it's pretty simple. And honestly, it's very similar, but just a few, a few fewer lines. So, yeah, let's get straight into it. Head on over to server script service and insert a server script. You guys can name this accessory script. Accessory. Uh, wait, not tripping. Accessory script delete print hello world as always then you can you can make a variable local is which is equal to game colon get service <clears throat> insert service then we'll skip two lines and we would do game dot players that player added colon connect function parentheses but plr which is short for the player then player dot chatted colon connect function in parentheses put msg which is short for the message then press enter then we are going to make a variable. We're going to do local command is equal to string dot sub. But then the message, uh, let me think. Okay, so if our command is going to be colon, if our, if our command is going to be colon uh, accessory, uh, that's, that's 10. Yeah, I think that's 10. So 110, and we are going to do if command is equal to colon accessory. Cause let me let me see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay yeah right then we're gonna get the uh the accessory ID so let's call it a a ID I guess and then we'll say string dot sub pretty much same thing but we're gonna do message and then ten so twelve right and then we're going to get the asset by doing local assets is equal to is load assets then put the asset id and then we're going to use a 4i v in pairs loop we're going to do 4i comma v in pairs then we're going to do assets get children enter and then we're going to say v dot parent is equal to character I forgot to make the character variable. What is I? We're going to make it right now. Let's do local character is equal to game that workspace find first child player name. And there we go. And just like that, we have made, uh, what's it called? And just like that, we have made, um, what is it called? Accessory command. All right. So we're going to need to test this real quick. Um, hmm. Oh, now I think about it. <laughs> I didn't actually get an accessory. I forgot to actually get an ID. Okay, uh, I guess I'll just delete one of my current accessories and then just use that ID. Uh, okay, we'll use the glass. Uh, no, let's use. Uh, I get, we could try the dress, I guess. We'll try the dress. Um, where's the ID for it? I don't even know. Or, um, I don't even know if I can get the ID, honestly, from here. Mm, which one size? Yeah, okay. I don't even think I could get the ID. Oh, never mind. There we go. Mm. Wait, that's the mesh ID. Mm. Mm. Hold on, I'm gonna have to see. Let me get in. Hold on, let me get. In. Let me get an accessory ID real quick. Cause it's like I honestly forgot. I honestly forgot the one. Honestly, forgot the one I uh, wanted to get. Mm, okay. All right. This is a random thing. So yeah, this is a random thing. I really just found. Okay. So colon accessory five eight zero six four one. I literally just got something in it. Okay. There we go. Oh, what the? F is this a fucking per? You know, it, it don't even matter. I'm just doing this for the video anyway. But yeah, as you guys can see, the command works and stuff like that. Again, I just used a random command. I don't even know. To, I don't even know what this is. But anyway, um, yeah, that's how you, that's how you do an accessory command. That simple. And yeah. Um, if y'all wanted to make it so it removed all your um accessories, then uh gave you whatever ones. I mean, that wouldn't really make sense because yeah, you you would more than likely just have a remove accessories command. It wouldn't make sense to yeah. If you wanted to make a remove accessories command. You could simply just change this up, uh, remove the whole asset and AID part, and you would uh, you would get uh, all children of the character. Then you would use an if statement and say if 
v dot if v is a accessory then v dot destroy or v colon destroy sorry and yeah that's how you do that if you were interested in that but anyway hope y'all hope y'all enjoyed the video and it was helpful if it was leave a like subscribe links to join my roblox group and discord can be found in the description and i appreciate y'all for watching and i'll see you guys